Hello and welcome. And this is another episode in our challenge. Vibe up to heart sink. How's your journey been so far? I'm sorry for some of the quality issues with the videos. When I did the initial videos that day, it has a lot of wind. And unfortunately, that made the quality a little bit bad. So I decided today to actually do another one on our compass today. So how does it go in general for you? How is the maps and the mapping? How is your 5D U? And how was the first map, uh, the first compass? So a compass seems to be something very crucial for me in order to find our way. And of course the heart is surely a beautiful compass. And sometimes we may look for other ways to be guided. Now, the sailors, if we want to call them that way, in the Pacific Ocean, they used, in a way, the Southern Cross as a compass to know where to go and to choose the best route that they possibly could. And the Incas have chosen the Southern Cross to integrate it into their Chacana. So the Chacana really is something like a compass. A compass that takes us into the different worlds, the unconscious and subconscious, the conscious and the superconscious. It takes us into the levels of our being the physical, the soul, the spirit level. And it takes us into also sacred force, like directions and elements and so much more. So when we go on this compass with the Chakana, we are really opening up a connection with the stars, with the Southern Cross, but also with our own soul's journey. So it was so exciting for us that we had actually created, we have created a Chakana compass that consists of a kind of a guidebook as a living medicine, activations, meditations, as a digital production. So if you're interested in that, you can find it in the link below. And if it calls you, you can even make your exchange and take it home to enjoy in your own space at your own pace. So what is compass for you? How do you feel about the Chakana as a compass? taking you in four directions, which is, of course, a nice metaphor and shows us that it's definitely connected to a compass. But it takes us to many different spaces within and beyond. So today is really an invitation to take your journey within and beyond. And the Chakana offers indeed many, many, many different opportunities to go on these journeys. And one of them I want to mention, because this is what we're also doing right now in this private unique retreat, is to go on the medicine wheel, which means going on the directions. And each direction has something to offer. So in the South, it's a lot about healing and letting go of what no longer serves. In the West, it's more about transforming what no longer is vital in your life. And we are also creating that and connecting that to the stories that we can break. In the North, it's more about the heart sink. While the heart plays a role all the way along, but here is really where we fully connect with the heart. And in the East, it's more about really putting the game up 
vibing up to live in that 5D version that you are. So there are no more sacred cows, as we call it in the medicine view. The, the burdens, the barriers, the obstacles that stop us from being all that we are, that 5D version, but more than the 5D version, this unique wholeness that we are. So to let go and transform, to heart sink and to vibe up are crucial parts. And the compass of the Chakana can take us there. So this is a little idea about the Chakana as a compass. You know how it goes. If you like it, you just press the button. If you feel this is the kind of content that is of value to you, that serves you, please subscribe. If you would like to make a comment or answer the question about the compass, then I would love to hear it. So what is that question that I'm asking you today? Do you have a compass for your journey? And is your compass related to your physical life from birth to death? Or do you have a Chakana compass that takes you beyond? So this is my question. Is the compass for life and death? Or is your compass also a Chakana compass that takes you beyond your soul's journey source fractal as we call it and your heart so thank you for being here today in vibe up to heart sink and thank you for enjoying this compass the chakana see you soon for more